<laughs> hey sis, the Boeings are here. Oh, make it all. What are they doing bringing beer in here? Oh, they'll just have a few off to the side. What can I do? I can't stop them. Are you drinking again? Why would you ask that? I know how you react when you're around him. Oh, he doesn't get to me anymore. <sighs> you want me to say something? I'll tell him to leave. I have no problem with that. <laughs> what about Cece? Tell her that her uncle has to leave. Happy birthday, honey, but your asshole uncle has to go. <laughs> Brian Cranston, that actor. You lie. He rode right by me. I swear it was him. Brian Cranston, the Breaking Bad guy. Shut up. Oh my God, he's one hunk of a red-headed man. Why didn't you pull up over? Oh yeah, that's a great idea. Why don't we pull over Brian Cranston? Why not? Well, please. I would have. Just hope that running away was the right thing, you know? Yeah, well it is. I know it is. You know what you should do? Hmm. It's something you never do. You should just... What? You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let your hair down. <laughs> Yeah, no, I should. I should. Can you imagine? I'll just let it down. Now. I don't wear it down. I wear it up, and I and I like it up. So. This is the new you, Marianne. You want to live dangerously? Do you? Then grab danger by the balls and do it. Do it. Change the ways. Fine. Fine. <laughs> Oh, good Lord, I don't know about that. No, I don't think so. So where are you at now? Fixing to pass Las Cruces. Florida? Here I come. It's gonna be so fun. Tracy? Mm. Tracy! Oh. What? Get the hell out of my house. What the hell? What? We're placing your daughter in the care of child services. Kelly, you are. Where is she? When you sober up, give me a call. We'll discuss your options. <laughs> Can't take my girl. Okay. Wendy! I warned you about this. I've given you so many chances. <laughs> Go ahead and take her. Fuck. I don't believe you. You can't take my girl. Oh. You can't take her. What the fuck? Wendy! You dirty bitch! Stay Leave my house. daughter alone! Give me my daughter back! Go back no. into the house! Tracy, this is how it has to be. Give me my daughter back! Does Father Bartoli have access to my mother's files? That's not possible. No one has access to those files. I haven't even seen them. How did you... How did you get this? I paid a visit to Father Bartoli's. It says in there that the first psychiatrist who evaluated my mother said that she was a... Her. She was a spirited girl who suffers from trauma but is mentally stable and resilient. Good morning. I'm CJ Craig. 
I'm Maggie Morningstar, Charles, and this is our tribal council, Jack Lonefeather. I'm sorry about your meeting, Mr. Cutler. I had to meet with some Northwestern governors about an important problem. Yes. It'll be no problem to reschedule the appointment. Oh, we can wait. Would you like to step into my office and we can try to reschedule it right now? We're fine here. Imagine our shock. Yes. In two generations, we'll be wiped out. If the potter keeps rolling along the way he is, I'd like to take some of that cash, you know, maybe put something together. So it'd be like a book? No, I was thinking more like a video, you know. I want something that says it all. There's a lot of guys out there teaching a lot of different things, but it's all based on power and strength. There's nothing wrong with a little effort. Oh, it's good to see him out here. And I have such a hard time getting away from that computer. If it hadn't been for him and the computer, I wouldn't be here. You know, every day I thank God and the angels for my blessings. Are you a religious man? Oh, more so since I got sick. We're gonna fix that. The doctors can't. The doctors don't know what we know. They do not have our traditional herbal remedies. You mean the stuff that medicine man carries in his pouch? <laughs> don't laugh. We're gonna make you well. But, um, you might have to stay for a while. This is Dennis, who you've already Hello. met. And this is Lainey Proudfoot of the Tribal Council. Nice to meet you. Hello. And this is Joe Sorgus. He's like the top kitty in all of this. Ah, the man I should be talking to then. Welcome. Dennis, shall we? Uh... Yeah, yeah, come on, let's go through, eh? Ooh. Somebody's having a baby, so you'll have to excuse me. Uh, right up. I'll catch up with you guys later. All right. Ready? Turn up, Pep. It's a big day, Johnny. How do you feel? I don't know. Uh, you know, for as much as you think that I helped you, you helped me too. We come from the same place, so talking all the time to a friend, it helps. It's healing for me. <laughs> 